Daily Outdoors is sponsored by Mr. Jinrai LLC. We are a company with the heart of a lion. Our logo is a symbol of pride alongside our aloha spirit. Our message is, be proud of who you are, have respect, and show love unto others. Always remember where you come from, stand strong, and never let negativity bring you down. Show the world you have the heart of a lion. To view all of Mr. Jinrai's amazing products, follow the link in the description below. Or if you find yourself in the Battlefield, Utah area, check out Murphy's Guitars, located at 133 North Main Street. For an exclusive line of Mr. Jinrai hats, supplies are limited. Mr. Jinrai, wear the heart of a lion. How's it going, Stay Outdoor family? Welcome back to another Stay Outdoors. It is the first hunt of mine for the extended season. Technically, the extended opened yesterday. Um, sorry, this is a quick opening for a segment. Up here, just above my house, right up in there. I was sitting out in my front yard and spotted a few deer. So I'm gonna go chase them real quick. Um, <laughs> I decided I'm gonna call this segment, yeah, it's gonna be the extended archer hunt, but I'm gonna call it Front Porch Hunter. Um, yeah, so this will be my Front Porch Hunter series. I think there's at least one buck in there, but even if it's all does, I'll try and get close, because, guys, my freezer's looking bare. It's, uh, it's not looking good. I need some meat. Um, if I am able to connect with the deer tonight, I am gonna go here soon and I'm gonna go buy an elk tag so I can go do some extended archery elk hunting. I think that'll be a fun fun little thing to do but let's get going. I should probably be watching what I'm doing. It took me all three minutes to drive up here to get about 200 yards below them. This, this is about as lazy as you can get with archery hunting I think. Um, I'm, just, I'm just cracking myself up right now. I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm hoping this works. I'm hoping, hoping one of them's a buck. Pretty sure one was, but not 100% positive. But, yeah, work my way that way. I know here in a minute. Alright, guys. So, just respotted them. They're right in the same spot. Time to get moving.
bush like this along the trail. I know it's just hopscotching along. Just trying to get up and around him. I'm behind him now. Just working on getting uh getting up above him. Got probably another 40 yards until we had enough to be above him and start moving in. Okay guys, so I don't know where it cut out there. I just barely, I got home and I had to charge my phone up so I could record this. Um, so what happened, you guys saw I stalked in, I don't know. Yeah, so I stalked in, got into those trees. I ended up even crawling through those trees and the deer were gone. I went all around it, tried to find out where they went, no clue. So they were just gone. I tried looking for them, never saw them again. But hey, you know what? I had fun, I had fun with this first segment of uh, front porch hunting. Um, but yeah, tell me what you guys think. I thought it was a fun little thing to go do. Tell me what you guys think. If you like this idea, or if you think I should just keep going deep woods. But thanks everyone for watching. We'll see you guys on the next one. Next time on Staley Outdoors. Here we go, guys. Finally, we got a blood trail. I can't wait to show you guys where this blood trail led me. And all the ups and downs and craziness and all the emotions out of it. You won't want to miss this next one. Stay tuned.